Hello everybody, welcome to another reaction to Fireman Sam. This should be, I would assume, uh, better than, <laughs> better, uh, than, uh, what that, whatever that monstrosity was we lost last month. Uh, we're no longer ready for action, I'll, I'll tell you that much. <laughs> so, uh, this is a Twitch points request by Shed. Thank you, Shed, for using your points on this. Uh, today we're going to watch an episode from Series 5, which is when the show came back after a 9-year hiatus, 11-year hiatus, actually. The show has a very interesting broadcast schedule. It is Series in 87, and then one in 88, and then one in 90, and then one in 94, and then one in 2005, and then it didn't come back again until 2008. So, it's been broadcast very, very interesting. I think this was the last... A series of a show uh, to use stop motion, I think. I'm pretty sure they went pure CGI in Series 6, um, so, which I'm sure was uh, controversial. Um, because I mean, stop motion objectively looks better. But he Shed just said any episode from Series 5, so we're going to do Series 5, Episode 1. This aired on April 4th, 2005. When he hears that fire alarm, Sam is always cool and calm. Got a remix. Okay. If you're stuck, give oh, come on, Norman. Shout. He'll be there to help you out. So move aside, make way for Fireman Sam, cause he's gonna save the day. Fireman Sam, cause That's a crazy day. turn, homie. <laughs> Oh Lord. Underground or in the air. Fireman <laughs> Sam and all the crew. They'll be there to rescue you. So move aside, make way for Fireman Sam, cause it's gonna save That's the job of life. Fireman Sam, cause it's brave to the core. Sam is the hero next door. Ready for action. <laughs> It's gonna curse me for the rest of my life. <laughs> Today, Norman Price, age seven, made history when he climbed to the age top of Santa Pandy Mountain. He arrived a whole hour before the world's top grown up mountain climbers and had these words to say. Ha ha, beat you! Pontypani Mountain, here I come. Uh, the, the seven? Bro's voice is way too deep to be Red. seven. Shut. It looks like he's 13. In good order. Thank you. Now, the children are on holiday this week, and you know what that means. Norman Price getting into trouble. Not just Norman. It could be any one of Pontypandy's children. But Third, probably not. Stand by for heads stuck in railings, children stuck up trees, and uh Sheep fallen off Pontypandy Mountain, sir. <laughs> that would be a mountain rescue situation, surely. I think Officer Cridlington was joking, sir. No, he isn't, Penny. We've had to rescue woolly wanderers before now. Anyway, we have to expect the unexpected. And the watchword is vigilance. And that means keeping an eye on Norman Price. So I said to her, I don't care if you're a tiger. That means we're pet. ready for it's not action. Coming in my shop. Uh, where do you think you're going with those, Norman Price? I'm just going to conquer the highest mountain in the world, ma'am. Well, make sure you're back in time for tea. Sorry, Bella. It's my Norman. He always starts when I'm on the phone. Oh, some nonsense about the highest mountain in the world. That's what you think, brother. I'll be so proud of me when I climb to the top and the queen makes me Sir Norman Price. Bro, seven my ass. Dealies, dealies. I legit are thought he was like. Whatever you doing, I thought this Bella? was like in the future. Out a new fashion? I was out of the back of picking. That's what I thought they were going for. <laughs> when whoosh! These washing blew over the street from your garden. Only my smalls, Bella. They won't do you any harm. Must have blown off my washing line. Oh, no, no. I checked when the first lot come over. There is no washing line, the dealies. Norman Price. <laughs> Oh, oh, concussion. Oh. Oh, they 
more than a few pebbles to stop Norman Price. Good thing he wore his helmet. Meh. It isn't like Norman to miss a picnic, especially when there are peanut butter sandwiches with chocolate sprinkles. Well, they already beat you. And cheese it. spread with pineapple chunks. What have you got, Mandy? Me? Just some cake left over from my cousin's party. We got toys, too. <laughs> oh, Lord. Mandy, you scared that little lamb. I was only trying to whistle like a bird. Sounded more like a charging elephant. Oh, no. He's running towards the cliff. Look. Uh, what? He'll <laughs> be all right. There's a one inside. <laughs> Sheep can't read, silly. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> Bro's dead. <laughs> oh, blooming pebbles are getting bigger. The weather forecast didn't say anything about it raining sheep today. Uh, that's convenient. Don't worry, Woolly. I've got you. Soon have you safe. On second thought, maybe we ought to stay here. Man. Someone's about to come looking for us. It's okay. He's fallen on something soft. Golly, it's Norman. <gasps> I'm going to get them. No, Bro, James, chill. it's too dangerous. Come back. Sarah's is right. We need to get help. Yeah, calm down there, Superman. The Let's call Fireman Sam. Fireman Sam? Does Fireman Sam have a helicopter? Service to require. Fire, Fire service, service, please. please. Helicopter service, please. A boy stuck on Ponta Party Mountain with a sheep. Norman Price. How are you going to... You see how high up he was? They're coming to rescue us. <laughs> All we have to do is eat gammy dodgers and wait. That's baller, honestly. Look, it's Fireman Sam. Yeah, and he's gonna do what? <laughs> Great. Now we'll get a ride home in Jupiter. Okay, Elvis, Penny, I'm going to try and reach him with the extending ladder. Stabilize Jupiter. Your ladder goes up that far? Okay. Sorry, Sam. I got a rope, yeah? I can throw it down to you, and then I can jump down and... Norman Price, <laughs> you've been watching too much TV. Only trying to help. Now look, yeah. sit tight. I'm going to have to call the mountain rescue helicopter. Thank you. Wow, cool. <laughs> Just sit still and be quiet, Norman. Pontapandi Fire Service to mountain rescue. Come in. Mountain rescue, Sam. We need the Mountain rescue, call. ready it's for Norman action. Again. He's stranded on Maiden's Leap. No trouble. Be there in two shakes of a lamb's tail. Over. What the hell? <laughs> Mrs. Price, is it? She's a bit upset, the <laughs> mister. I heard about our little lad. Mind if I film the rescue for the news? All right, go ahead. As long as you don't upset my Norman. He's very sensitive, you know. Hurry up, Sam. I want my tea. Uh, well, he's eating all my biscuits. Won't be long, Norman. Hang on. Sam. Why'd they I add Tom Cruise to the show? <laughs> Might loosen more rocks or hit the cliff with more rotors. Over. Roger, Tom. Can you Australian lower the Australian Tom Cruise. <laughs> I'll try. Well, will Norman be able to catch it? <laughs> I'll be doing the catching. Over. Right, Norman. This is what I'm going to do. Put that harness on, then swing across to pick you up. Like Tarzan, you mean? No. Tarzan wasn't a trained firefighter, was he? Sure this it was. This is safe. Okay, Tom. Lift at about 10 meters, will you? Brilliant, this is. Be the big story on the news. Dillies, your little lamb has a rescue the lamb. Oh, I'm too scared to look. I'm absolutely putrefied. Oh. Hold on to me, Norman. What about Woolly? I'll have to come back for him. I'm not leaving him on his own. Norman, don't argue. You're being rescued. 
Oops. Oh yeah, good job, Sam. Yoink! Okay, Tom, bring us up. Keep your fleece on, Willy. I've got you. Don't argue. You're being rescued, oh. crazy. Oh, just clean Jupiter this morning and all. We'll be hammering out the dents this afternoon. Be glad when the school holiday's over. I will. Oh, concussion. Hip hip hooray! Sammy has it done it. I'm gonna use that washing light to tie Norman to me this holiday, so I know exactly where he is. What an adventure, Norman! You were so brave! So stupid, you mean? You're right, Mandy. It was a silly thing to do. Still, what? Fair play, Norman. You did save Wooly. They did Sorry. it too! I just can't help being a hero. The other kids climbed the mountain too! Bro! Norman gets singled out in this version oh, too! Ma'am. I was only trying to be famous. This is just like ready for Being action. The <laughs> news is the sort of fame you can do without. What happened to that nice green salad I did for you? Salad? Meh. No, man. Nah. <laughs> <laughs> I cannot believe it. Norman gets singled out in this version, too. The other kids also climbed the mountain. Can we talk about how they got up there? And how'd they get down, also? Like, how did they get up and down? They were higher than Norman was. Hello? <laughs> Arrest them, children. Police! Illegal climbing. Jesus Christ, poor Norman. Boy, so, that was, it was, I, I, I'm, almost, I'm tempted to almost watch a Series 6 episode just to see how much worse it was, animation-wise, because, I mean, CGI, we've, CGI is just objectively worse. Um, but, I don't know. We'll see. Um, for now, justice for Norman. That is it for another episode of Fireman Zam. Thank you guys for watching. If you liked the video, be sure to leave it a like. If you didn't like it, don't. <clears throat> if you want, ooh, ow. If you want to follow any of my social media links, they're all in the video description down below, as well as names of all my Patreons you didn't know. You can be Patreon me for as well as $1, one pound, and you can access to reaction videos, well as reading comments with the daily, sometimes more. All being said, though, my name is Stafford Seen. It's been my, hmm, like, counting ready for action, maybe fourth? Reaction to Fireman Sam, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.